Hey, welcome to another episode of our Legacy Challenge. And y'all, why you didn't tell me I didn't put a roof on this house? Okay, it's my fault, I know. But I have put a roof on so that we don't look as raggedy as... <laughs> as we did ending off in episode two. But we have lots of very, very good things today. Very exciting things happening today and a special surprise at the very end of the episode. So make sure you guys stay tuned, okay? We got some good things going on. As you can see, she's just catching up on some sleet. She had a uh, sleep, sleet, S what? What word? She's catching up on some sleep. Last night, she was hanging out with Gobias, you know what I'm saying? Just working on their little relationship that's developing. And so I will say the winner of <laughs> who's going to bring in our next generation is good old Gobias. Now, Gobias has potential. We're going to have to give him a full on makeover, y'all. We, we will. We will. We do still have a little bit of a relationship with Joffrey, but I do think Gobias and I have a better connection. So let's, uh, we'll see, we'll explore a little bit more about that today, but he doesn't have the best traits, y'all. We can already see he's childish. Flirty is okay, but childish, I don't know. But look at, look under miscellaneous. <laughs> rich, <laughs> very rich. We love to see it. Now, um, we are going to go ahead and just make sure she's fully rested for this nice long day she has. She actually has to work at uh, three o'clock p.m. And I did, oh, I almost forgot to tell you guys, she got promoted. Yes, so she is now a roadie, which means she basically, I'll insert a little clip of her getting promoted. Um, roadies basically help them, you know, get all the food and they're, they're do girls, do girls and do boys. Okay. Roadies just get the band members, whatever they need, pick up their, their significant others, bring them to shows, all that good stuff. So we did get promoted. So we make $25 an hour now. Okay, so that's a nice little promotion. I'm happy about it. I am not mad. So we're gonna go ahead and go to work. And then after work, let's go ahead and make sure we work hard. We wanna we wanna get promoted so that we can make more money fast. But um, after work today, we're gonna visit Gabias. And y'all, I, I almost forgot to tell you guys too. So I've been noticing people on the outside of our building diving this dumpster. So I click on it. I did not realize we could dumpster dive and we can do this. And she's happy about doing this because she's a frugal sim. And we found a number of different things, like a number of different things. Let me, I'm going to go ahead and insert a clip so you guys can see it. And I'm telling y'all right now, I was dying. When I tell you I was crying laughing from her literally like breathing and making noises while she's diving in a dumpster to... <laughs> <laughs> to all the cans and glass breaking from shit falling out of the dumpster i was i was dead i could not i couldn't deal um but yeah we found a couple of things so we found uh pens and pencils perfume set iron a moth which is just like mm -hmm. um i think we found this bistro chair and also this little decor item we can maybe set this here we could just use it as a little seating area we made a good little little bit of money. I'm not mad at it from doing a little dumpster diving. So that's something <laughs> that's something we can maybe continue to utilize. But yeah, let's go ahead and finish up our work day and then we can we'll meet up with Gobias afterwards. Oh hold on Hank. Hold on, Hank. Oh, come on, y'all. Hank kind of fine, y'all. He a police officer though? Mm. I don't know. They don't make a lot of money. <laughs> Unless you decapitate. Okay, so it says, now that you're a roadie, it means long hours spent upon um, setting up speakers, lights, and really cool fire fountains. Reading Life of the Hard Rocky Road will help to prevent unfortunate burns from the, I'm sorry, burns from the equipment. Raise your job performance and increase your relationship with your boss. Yeah, I mean, we could, we could definitely read the book. I don't see, I don't see a problem with that at all. You guys pointed out that when they ring the doorbell and kind of like wait on them to answer, they have like a little oh, waiting interaction. Oh, look, he's excited to see us. Okay, that's cute. Let's go up here. Yeah, let, what, why are we staying right in this same spot? She said, come on, Gabias. Okay, so I think we should ask him, can we stay over? Like, can I spend the night? What do you say? <laughs> Is, is that how she asked if she could stay the night? He said, sure, make yourself right at home. Y'all, look at how Gobias is really hugging her right now. Like, he is doing... <laughs> he is infatuated. I'm not mad at him, though. Uh-oh. Come on, y'all. Look, so they, they do have a pretty strong relationship, like I was saying. <gasps> Come on, first kiss. That little pet? Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> okay, it's it's settled. Hello? No, no way. No way. No way. <laughs> Is this a joke? I can't believe I just witnessed that. Mm, so that's what he does with all the mirrors? Uh, is that his oh yeah he gonna need a he gonna need a full-on makeover y'all he back in the mirror again y'all i can't not this oh my god he is childish in every sense of the world look at his clothes invite to cuddle <gasps> that is so cool she just leaned up on the bed and asked him to come over he said absolutely i will <laughs> Okay, from the looks of it, I will say last night was a success, baby. A success. Okay, I don't know what goodbye is working with, but sheesh. They are sleeping real good right now. So we're gonna let them sleep. Taking a look just around the house. I'm just I'm just trying to scope the place out a little bit. But he's got a lot of money, guys. I mean, it's not the largest house in Sunset Valley, but I mean it's a lot of stuff here okay i do like that he can garden as well um the only thing is just like why why this tv why that tv it's fine it's totally fine so we are gonna go ahead and get up here in a minute because she is off from work and i think they should have like a little date day today you know what i'm saying this is all about them today in this episode <laughs> But she definitely laid it on him last night. So I think she's going to take full advantage of them being here. She's going to use and then use the bathroom and also take a bath. Look at this, y'all. She said, I ain't never, ever seen nothing like this in my life. <laughs> Look at this bathroom. Oh, not the pigtails. Not the pigtails, baby. No way. But this is very bougie. Very bougie. She's like, oh. I'm going to enjoy myself. And I think they can go out and just grab a little bit of lunch. I think that would be nice. This man's in the mirrors again. No way you're in the mirrors again. Goodbye. Stop it. She said, can we go to the nice restaurant in town? He's like, of course. Why not? Why not? Let's go to, we're going to go, we could go to the diner, but why do that when we can go eat at a nice restaurant can you eat outside with the date that'll be nice let's do that it's a perfect day for that actually i think this will be like one of my i remember doing this back in the day when i was playing the sims 3 but it'll be a nice refresher to see if they actually sit outside and eat he's like hop on in girl we don't take taxis i got a car <laughs> Oh, he said i got a car i can take us wherever we need to go look at the little hearts floating above the car i love it to symbolize them on a date how are we feeling so far about goodbyes, guys? How are we feeling? Hopefully we can get an, oh, not our, not our, um, our crush outside. Mm, somebody go ahead and get him out of here. <laughs> I don't know. Will this work? Let's see. Oh, yes, it, it does. Okay, so they go in and get something to eat. Y'all got dessert. Really? Okay. <laughs> really? I wish, can Brie change into like anything else? This is so cute. Again, this is so good for a rabbit hole because at least you can you you can eat outside still. This is so nice. 